All right, what's up, everybody? Pokey Jmart bringing you back another episode. It's December 18th. Today, we're going to be cracking an older box set that I've been hanging on for some time. Okay. Stand by. Let me just get that off my screen. There we go. Okay, so it's an ancient power box. Okay, so it's got... Let me just see something real quick. It's got some promos, I would assume. Uh, the four hollow promos on the front there. <clears throat> the... Uh, you know, the stage one, and then, or rather, the original, and then the stage one of each one. It looks like these uh, evolved from, like, some type of fossil type. And then we got uh, a fossil researcher uh, hollowed out. Um, that's a common. So, I'm thinking maybe these might not be promos then. But anyway, nice thing about this is we got a Furious Fist, a Flash Fire, and a Furious Fist. So, never know what you're going to pull out of that. That'd be cool. Quote, unquote, vintage pack, because those are no longer printed. And then I've had this pretty much since day one it came out. Got this about, a, you know, within a week of it coming out. This was the Break Evolution box. This came out when they started doing all the break cards um, shortly thereafter. I think it's got an Ancient Origins, a Fates, Breakthrough, uh, what else? Breakpoint, and then the Fates. So anyway, some promos here. Two, uh, two promo uh, break cards, which the hoe is really cool looking. Just kind of opening this, I decided to open this because, you know, we just had, uh, we just had, uh, come on, help me out here, uh, Burning Shadows not too long ago, that was a big, you know, ho set, and then the ho has been kind of popular right now, obviously, uh, you got uh, Lugia and Ho on each side, left and right. Okay, so we're going to crack this, but that's been in my collection, oh man, it's been in my collection probably for a year and a half easily, this thing was released a long time ago, I'm going to try to keep this box nice. You know what, guys? I'll tell you what. I should have been using this this particular knife. I should have been using this since day one. This thing is like 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 a hot knife through semi melted butter, dude. It is just gorgeous, gorgeous. Okay, that's what we just cracked. I'm gonna lay that down. Boom. Okay, we'll open this up. If I actually can do it, so he wants to fight me. Uh, we're not gonna get too crazy into it. Uh, there's the Ho-Ho, the Wobbuffet, uh, Lugia, and the Standard Ho. Now, I have no idea if these are really any good playable or not. Not really sure. Not gonna get into it, but these are all promos, X and Y's. Okay, we got the Jumbo card. Got the Ho-Ho Break card in Jumbo form. Now, is that the normal size? of Yeah, that appears to be. This is just throwing, throwing me off because it's sideways, because it's a break card. These always feel so flimsy. Just, they're just so, I don't know, they're so big. They don't, make, they don't make the card stock any bigger than the normal print. All right, Fates. <coughs> well, Ancient Origins, that's cool. That'll be a nice one. Okay. Right, nice little five-packer. I'm going to throw this back in here, and then leave that bad boy up in the original box it came in once I get those cards popped. Alright, so let's crack these, and we'll move on to the second box afterward. Um, let's try to think here. Yeah, okay. Let's go, let's, let's save Ancient Origins for last. How's that sound like a plant, plant, sound like a plant stand? Sound like a plant stand? Okay. Got Pokemon Breeder Mewtwo GX, Zorox GX. Shining Plaza and Shining Jirachi on display in the back. And of course, the three Pikachu still on display. And we got a Haxorus. as a Hollow and a Reverse Pancham. And that was Breakthrough. Um, Bridget would have been phenomenal. Only because I don't feel like paying for it. $20. I'll be giving out code cards as we go, as per usual. Breakpoint. Um, full art trainer, I guess, would be cool. Out of this. A trubbish enemy out stick. Talk about some trash. Trash pool, y'all. A trash pool. A delinquent. In a, in a gabite. In a gabite? Alright. Code card. Boom. Break point. Have fun with that. Fates Collide coming out. Let's get it on. I'm going to be annoyed if every single pack is BS. Kangaskhan and an Audino EX. What was that? That was out of fates. 
Okay, we just pulled an Audino out of Fates uh, probably a month ago. Drain Slap, do the wave, HP 180, Audino EX. It's all precious. It's all precious? Alright. Mega Catcher and a Braxian. Oh, Lord. Uh, Mega Audino EX would have been cool because I don't think I've ever pulled that card. And it won, what, 2016 Worlds? So that's always cool. Even though you don't hear from that, like, you don't hear from that, uh, at all anymore. If you ever see me do this or whatever, just to get the focus back into, uh, whatever. Get back into focus, I guess you can say. Alright, we got a Chinchino, Cincino, and a Barbacool. Pretty lame, y'all. Absolutely no trainer or support cards in that. Wow, look at that. That's amazing. Hmm. Usually I have a whole, uh, full pack full of Pokemon. All right, Ancient Origins. All right. Something cool out of this would be baller. Secret Rare. Secret Rare? Ancient Origins. Um, yeah. I'm just trying to think what's in this. And for a Spirit Link. Regice. 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 Wow. And for a spirit link. I mean, that's a cool looking card, but unfortunately it doesn't help me. That's an uncommon. Okay. Okay. A little disappointing. A little disappointing for that. So, five packs out of that. We pulled one EX. Uh, EX we did not need. Or really one for that matter. <laughs> uh, God love it. Okay. Moving on to. Ancient Power Box. Don't really remember why I got this. Um, um, yeah, I don't know if I got it at Walmart or got it off. Of, I might have got it off a of dude at a flea market. Um, still for the original price, would have you know original MSRP price. I looked this up on Amazon the other day. It really wasn't that much more. It was only like I think this sold for twenty original MSRP. I think I saw one for like 26, so it wasn't like way, you know, a ton more money. Um, I don't know, I've been sitting on this for a while, I figured just crack it. It's not like it's going to go up in price, I doubt, too much. Real, okay, alright, here's the deal. Apparently these are not promos. Okay, I assume they're just out of the regular set. So now the question is, are the two restored basic style Pokemon, the Tyrant and the Amarua, um, are they, I wonder if they're to be non-hollow originally in that set. Something fell out of my, something fell out of this box. What's this? Uh, so this is a, okay, so I was right. Yeah, they are fossil based. So apparently they, they reintroduced the fossil. So apparently you got a little insert with this. Okay, that's unusual to get an insert with a box set like this. Um, so this is back when people used to play fossil cards, kind of like, uh, back, back in the day, Jungle with Fossil, you actually had to put that Fossil card to evolve uh, Om Omnite, Kabuto, and Aerodactyl. Same kind of concept, I assume. Fossil, apparently Fossil Researcher does something as well. Search your deck for up to two any combinations of Amura, Tyrant, put them on your bench. Yeah, so it's kind of a quicker, cheap way to get them on the bench, I think. Because it sounded like you needed Jaw Fossil or Sail Fossil by itself to get it on the bench. So that was a quicker way to get it on the bench. All right, put that in there. Let me pull this off to the side, you guys. I'm off to the side of the camera. I just want to open this up casually. I don't know if these cards are going to come flying out or not. I don't know how they're in here. Probably the old way, the four lips. Yeah, looks like we got two. Uh, yeah, two lips. Yeah, two lips holding each one in. So that's not terrible. Pop the first lip and then go from there. Should be alright. Alright, I'm really pumped about this uh, Flash Flyer pack, I must say. Alright, no code card apparently. Apparently they didn't do that back then. I don't know. Maybe. I don't know how old these, these boxes. But that right there is just pretty cool looking. I don't know, I like the way that looks. You got the Flash Flyer, the Furious Fist on the side. Yeah, buddy. Vintage. And freeze. Okay. I wonder if that'll make that my thumbnail. Alright. Here we go. No Patrick. We're just gonna get right to it. 
Pet Rat. We're gonna just we'll, we'll go through them just because they're a little older. Eevee. Uh, Sc Scorruppy. I'm just like Scorpion. Uh, ooh, Cup. Ooh, Cup Chew. I've never pulled that card. Never pulled this card. Cub Chew. Kind of gross. It's like snotting. Uh, slacking. Uh, slacking. Slaw. Ooh, reverse Magmar, which unfortunately is a common. And the Leafeon. All right, that would have been cool. I don't know if that's a hollow in this set, but that you know what? That would have been cool having pulled that as a hollow. Because I've like, never seen this card. Tool Retriever. Him on top. Energy Switch. And Code Card. Yeah, that would have been cool. Now, if you remember uh, about a month back or so, um, Pookie Bro, Mark, uh, Mark and I, um, he we opened up a Flash Fire pack, and we ended up pulling the uh, the non-secret rare Mega Charizard in that. So that was pretty sweet. I always wanted to pull that. Although, it's, you know, it's not like the Mega Ver or the, the what am I trying to say? The, uh, the um, secret rare version. But still sweet. I always wanted it, and I got it. Bear Trick is the reverse, which is a rare. Oh, and a Hollow Victory Bell. Okay, kind of cool. Again, I, I I wonder if that um, I wonder if that Leafeon would have been hollow. Good looking, good looking card. Kind of takes me back. Kind of reminds me of the older cards. Yeah, absolutely. Good looking hollow. Um. Hmm. Heals 30 damage, does 60, makes you 130. I don't know, I kind of like this card. I do. I always have a little soft spot for this, for Victory Bell. Uh, Fighting Stadium, a Watchdog, and a Sail Fossil. That's not the Fossil card we were just talking about. And the Code card. Unfortunately, I am going to say that I think, I think I pulled this Victory Bell before. Because I've opened, you know, quite a few uh, Furious Fist packs in the past. And I think I pulled that card, but who knows. I did or didn't. Alright, bear with me 30 seconds while I do a little deck maintenance. And if I can actually put the cards where I want to put them. Alright, flash fire, baby. Let's get her done. Cross your fingers, y'all. Shinx. Sandile. Sadat. Sadat. A Pidgey. Stunky. Ooh, a dust call. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. Oh, weak. I don't think it's going to be hollow. Fortress. Why couldn't this have been a hollow? Fortress. Sneasel. Mill tank. Oh, rough and gen 2. Torkoal. And the code card. Well, I can't win them all, I guess. Can't win them all. Weak sauce. Alright, let me see what we got. Okay, the dust call. Yeah, can't win them all, y'all. I mean, did I think I was going to pull that charger? Not really, but it would have been fantastic. All right, guys. I do have a Volcanian uh, box set uh, over there yet from, like, way back in the day. That was one of the ones that people were buying, you know, GameStop, like crazy. Um, and then I got uh, Magirna Mythical Collection as well. Came around, around came out around the same time. I'll be saving that. I'm going to be having a lot more content come in um, end of December, early January. I'm also going to be doing some more card showcases, uh, where I just show us like individual cards, stuff I've acquired, uh, you know, or whatever. Um, probably going to be getting some, trying to complete some, you know, the regular GX, like the regular GX form, the full art form, and then the rainbow rare form. I have, I'm going to have like all three. I'm going to try to complete each and every one. That's the goal. I don't know. Um, get kind of, I'm getting there. I should be a lot closer after Christmas. Um, I will showcase this bad boy here real quick. I got a red binder here. Um, it's not my red binder. I bought it off some dudes. And what's inside is pretty cool. Um, it's nothing like phenomenal, like real great, but it's still pretty cool. Um, let me see if I can angle this down slightly better. Stay with me, you guys. Do it so it's looking at the table more. That's pretty good, right? Is that good? Anymore, it's going to fall forward. All right, so real quick. Um, I did get this from Facebook Marketplace. I met some dude in a, in a parking lot. <laughs> it's pretty cool. It's nothing. It's not complete or anything, but it's just all a bunch of, uh, you know, jungle fossil base. 
what was cool is uh, two Halloweenosaurs right here and right here. Um, two Halloweenosaurs, okay. So that's cool. Uh, you figure Hollow Hollow Venusaur Mints go for 2020, 2025, depending. Um, that right there paid for what I what I spent. I, I got real lucky on this. Uh, Hollow Nitto Queen. I'm just gonna point out right here, top right. I'm just gonna point out some of the better ones. It's just it's just cool seeing these older older cards. Especially you got to see them in Evo. You know, you figure okay, all the new all the new people to the game got to see them in Evo, and all the old all the old dudes like myself got to relive our relive our childhood a little bit for you know all but. A couple months, but um, obviously they didn't do Jungle Fossil, so it's still cool seeing you know like Butterfree and Weezing and then those guys. Um, here's a Hollow Dark Weezing here at the top. Hollow uh, Venomoth here. I figured all the Hollows are at the top. Hollow Venomoth. Okay. A bunch of Ekans again. It's just and um. Most of these cards, from what I can tell, I mean, the backs are great looking. I mean, they're phenomenal. Um, very little white, you know, whiting edges. Um, they look good. Very little wear and tear in general. Um, I'm pretty pumped about it. Got this on, on a steel. Okay, we'll keep moving here. Gold Bat, Dark Um There are some random uh, first editions through, through and out. Uh, Jim Hero series as well. This is a first edition. Um, Erica's Execute. That's cool. Um, I don't, I'd like to know what was on this page, I don't know. Um, unfortunately, no hollow Gengars, no hollow Hypnos. That would've been cool. They're all, they're not hollows. Those would've been hollows. Uh, there's a hollow Hypno here. Hollow Hypno here. And, uh, first edition, uh, Sabrina Slowpoke. I was really hoping for, like, some Gym Heroes and, um, some Neo Genesis and, like, you know, maybe just paid a little bit more, but it seems like you wanted to get rid of them, so. Uh, Promo Mew, uh, from the movie. Hollow Mewtwo, base set, uh, promo Mew, also from, I think, the movies. So that's cool. And again, they're like, I mean, they're, you know, they're not like, the Mewtwo's not mint, but it's a shame because this this is the Mewtwo here. Um, a little bit of white edging right here, that's where my finger is. Um, but other than that, man, it's like, it's like good. It's a shame that that white, white edging right there would always be perfect. Um, Misty's Cloister, first edition, top right. You know, it's just some cool stuff. You know, I, I don't know. I, I don't know if you guys enjoy see, watching this or looking at this. I know some guys do. I've had people uh, DM me and say you know they like it, but um, I know some of the you know, one Pokey Bray likes checking out some of the older cards too. I love it. I love it. I wish more guys would do this. Um, Cedra, Poliwhirl. Again, there's nothing like crazy, crazy in here. I mean, there are some, you know, uh, hollow lappers. You know, right here, hollow lappers, for example. A couple hollows on every couple pages. You know, every once in a while you have one. Um, it's cool, like it's just cool seeing some of the old, the old ones. And what's nice is you know I got a whole bunch of them now. Uh, Hollow Magneton right here, like what you would have saw on Evo. Um, unfortunately, none of these are the Red Cheek Pikachu. I was hoping one of them would have been. That could have been Hollow. Uh, that's a first edition of the Tennis Series Pikachu. So there's first editions in here. They're great condition. Uh, Fossil Zapdos Hollow. Can't beat that. I got that. I kind of was pumped to see that. I love Zapdos. He's my boy. Um, base set two uh, Pikachu. Like there's a whole variety of stuff in here, all from 1998, 1999 to 2000. Uh, first edition Blaine's Volpix. Oh, oh, that was nice. Hollow Nine Tails. That was, that was cool. Hollow Nine Tails. That's in pretty good condition. Just like a, just a little nick on the top in the middle. Uh, Hollow Flareon would have been cool, but unfortunately no dice on that. Um, I used to use this Golem all the time in the TCG, and I don't know why nobody ever did, but I always did. The HP was pretty high. It wasn't like wasn't the highest, which is kind of dumb. I always thought this should be pretty high because it's stage uh, two Pokemon, but um, it did. It hit for sixty, and then it had uh, self destruct for a hundred, right? Self destruct for a hundred. So what I would do is like if I was getting really close to the end of the game and I had like maybe like one card to go to win it, I would just do that self destruct move and just just win it. It was oh my god, the one guy got so mad the one time I did that. Um. Because there's no way he's going up against the 100 attack moves. It's beautiful. How the Kabutops, that is really good looking. Just something about the old Kabutops is a shame that's not first edition. But something about the old Hollow Kabutops is just great. I'd love to open. I really would love to open a, a booster box of Fossil again. Some really good cards in that. Um, really good condition. That that card's probably, I would say, mint. Easily 9.5. First edition Brock Shantru. 
It's a shame this is not first edition. That would have been sick because that's easily like, you know, $15 card, TCG, or, you know, maybe more depending on the right buyer, but yeah, that would be sweet. Uh, Fossil Snorlax Hollow. You guys remember that? That was reprinted right around Evo time. Non Hollow Kangaskhan. Shame. Shame. Um, the old school Eevees. I love that artwork. Jigglypuff. It's a shame you don't get that like that warm fuzzy feeling like you used to when you were a kid. When you open up a fresh pack of cards. And the, the smell. The smell of a fresh pack of Pokemon cards. There was, nothing, there was nothing quite like it. And it just, man, it takes me back. I miss that smell. I wish the new cards, like every once in a while, you know, I'll give, I'll give the new cards a good whiff straight out the pack. Ah, but <laughs> a little bit of crack cocaine on the side. But no, seriously, um, you know, it's just, I don't know, guys. It's weird. It doesn't smell the same. I don't know how to describe it. It just had a different smell to it. I think it's because Wizards of the Coast produced it. I've opened the old pack a few months back. Old camera. Tried to smell it. it was just, it's been sitting so long, it lost the, the original scent. A couple trainers in here. Misty's D Dual, Pokeball, Bill. You know, some Poke Flute. The, a couple of these are star, uh, rare quality of star, star rarity symbol. Uh, Lass. Uh, and here's the mysterious fossils we were talking about. You would have needed that for Kabuto, Omnite, and uh, Aerodactyl. Omnite. Oh man, Pokemon! Oh man, it does. What's going on? Uh, revive, computer search. Almost done. There's one in the back that should have been a hollow, but it's not. Not right here. Rocket sneak attack. That that could have been a hollow, but it's not. I actually have uh, like three of these in hollow first edition. That's cool. Um, what's cool is you got some Brock's training method, first edition. Digger out of uh, Team Rocket. Uh, Erica, an Erica trainer, first edition. Mr. Fuji, Professor Oak, the Nightly Garbage Run, and Sleep. So I don't know. I just want to show that, guys. I got that Facebook Marketplace for a hell of a deal. Um, like I said, the two Venusaurs in the front basically pay for what I paid. Um, and they're all but mint. So, got about maybe, I got about maybe, I think six or seven Halloween stores now in, in my collection. Alright, guys, uh, thanks for watching. Like, comment, share, subscribe. Like, comment, share, subscribe. And, um, yeah, let's do some more stuff. We'll get it going. Uh, tell your friends, tell your, tell your buddy, your neighbor, your cousin, your girlfriend, your uncle. Whoever you want to tell, uh, let's get it going. Let's get more people rocking and rolling. And uh, you know, at that point, we can we can do some more. We can do some more openings. We can do some more giveaways. I'd, I'd love to do it, guys. I'd love to do it. I got a whole bulk bulk box down here. If you want it, let me know. Um, for something like that, that bulk box, if you want that, you got to come to me. Though I can't I can't ship an entire box full of Pokemon cards. That shipping would just be astronomical. All right, guys, like, comment, share, subscribe, and Hokey J Mart deuces. Catch you in a week. Peace.